It's the key. The way that it's the key works is you can't pick up bombs, coins, or hearts. The way that I choose to do that is we play as the lost. Hello. Kate, we just had like probably the most incredible run uh, you'll ever see in Isaac in your life. It's the strongest run I've ever seen. I've got to remind myself on this one. We're going to not pick up anything but keys and we go to the lamb. Nothing but keys and we go to the lamb. The lamb. Keys only go to the lamb. That's a joke. That's actually a slap in the damn face. You can take pills and stuff, but it's like I'm not trying to complicate things. How have you not done this before? I have, but on a different save file. Keys only go to the lamb. Hey, Dog Tanyan, thanks for the gifted subs. Thank you. Yeah, you you start with the uh, with the coin. I had to look that up earlier today. Lost starts with one coin. Feels weird to be just like on a floor. What do you get when you do it? I have no idea, honestly. Uh, I don't know what you get for it, but it just has to be done. Oh, you get Ace of Spades? Do I, re I guess I, I, I really do only see like Ace of Clubs, Ace of Hearts. You're free from the grind. Now, this is like the last um, thing we would have to do, except for picking up random items. But picking up random items can happen on random runs. So this is like our last bespoke, actual, annoying, I will become back my money type challenge. Very excited. Oh, we, a smart man, Cobalt Streak, once said, always re-roll the boss pool. It's all right. We don't we don't sweat it till we get our deal with the uh, our deal with the devil. See what our deal with the devil is going to be. Clip farmed. Clip farmed. Thanks, Cobalt. <laughs> That's not Cobalt's fault. Just remember, we're not picking up anything but keys, keys, and don't stand in the center of a room. Funny joke. You can't do that. Oh, oh, that scared the crap out of me, man. You are the center of a protractor? That almost got me, too. You can do a seeded challenge on this one. The seed gone soon makes consumables disappear after a few seconds. You know what? If it happens, it happens. It's actually a pretty good... Actually, that's an amazing trinket. No, actually, it kind of sucks. Um, I don't know what I was thinking there. That doesn't count, by the way, but you gotta check it. Um, but it at least allows us to go into the curse room. It's a freaking chess match, man. Um, and then... Was my, was my point here? Oh, yeah. I thought maybe we can go into self-sacrifice rooms, but that's not the point. That's, uh, you know, I, you, you can't actually play him with this. Yeah, you can take keys on this challenge. You just can't take anything else. Uh, well, you can take pills and runes and cards, but I'm, like, scared. He has a penny. You start with a penny when you play as the Lost. As the Lost, you start with a penny. This was covered in the, in the earlier part of the lecture, but that's okay. It's also part of the required reading, The Binding of Isaac Wiki at PlatinumGod.co.uk. And you have a key. Yeah, the, the key you can... You know what? Maybe, 
It's easier if you just tune out. <laughs> is there is there an adult that can watch this run for you? Because I'm worried for your well-being right now. Is there someone you can talk to? You all I ask is that you at least watch this in. Uh, Reboot your computer into safe mode to watch this, okay? Because I, I don't I don't want you to get hurt on this one. Yo, T edits. I like your uh, your custom peepo G frog paper. <laughs> Shrek Shrek deck liquor. <laughs> Thanks for the gifted subscriptions. <laughs> What a name. What a name. I wanted to make sure I got that one completely correct. You're an actual piece of shit. How many HP upgrades are they gonna give me, man? We can't even reroll it yet because we gotta reroll the, uh, the deal with the devil item instead. Or at least save it for the possibility. I got no items so far. Yeah, we're on the second floor. I got no items. Ruka, I swear to God, if you try to get in the cords right now. Oh, oh, ah, ah, ah. Where are you going? Where are you going? Under the board game shelf is okay. You want to go under the board game shelf? That's fine. Otherwise, I got to kick you out of here. As you get down to the cords, I'm going to lose my mind. Ruka. Give it a second. There you go. He's under the board game shelf. He could, at any given time, he could sneak into my periphery and get into those cables, though. No, I'm not going to replace the cables with barbed wire. Not only is it bad for the well-being of my beloved pets, but also I don't think they like conduct electricity as well as a copper wire. Also, I don't even know where you buy barbed wire. I don't even know how to handle it. I don't know. I'm not capable of that kind of stuff. I don't I don't have the cognitive capacity to lead. Okay, fine, I'll do it. Good, good item. You know what? It could be Krampus in there. Just go snag that. You just take Succubus is good enough. Then you go back. And you reroll. These are good items. These are good items. You don't pick those up. You go hurry roll. The speed upgrade. Why not do this with Tainted King? Well, do you want like the answer that's gonna annoy people? Like, because I hate playing as Tainted Cain. Especially while being watched. <laughs> but the other reason is I like being uh, the Lost on this one. Because you're, it's it's hard to get HP. And as the Lost, that doesn't matter. And you get to take a deal with the devil for free. So there's the real answer. All right. Remind yourself, every floor we remind ourselves. We don't pick up anything but keys. Not allowed to get anything but keys. Not that. Will there be a return to Borlax at some point? Oh, absolutely. I, uh, I mean, there's some irony in this for sure, but I was like, today I want a little variety. Uh, so it, I, instead of playing Pokemon Unite, which I played for four hours yesterday, I'm like, let's just play five hours of Isaac instead. But, you should note, once we're done with the- Oh, never stand in the center of the room there. Once we're done with this five hours of Isaac, the dream is that we can then play it much more flexibly. I really feel like if I hadn't given myself this five hour block today to just knock out the really, really long challenges, then I, I probably would have dragged my heels and. I was going to say never do them, but that's not true. It would have taken me a lot longer. 
Uh, Raykins2207. Thank you. For the gifted subs as well. Thank you. You know, sometimes... It's like when you... You could... Do a little bit of cleaning every day. A little tidying. I don't know what that is right now. Uh, every day. But some people find it better to just be like, okay, it's the, you know, spring cleaning. I'm going to clean my whole house. That's what we're doing right now. We're cleaning our house. It's poop brim. So it's... it's so it's brim. I hate this guy, by the way. Yep. Just chill. Take a deep breath. Let Succubus do some work. You ever see the movie As Good As It Gets? Starring Jack Nicholson? This is the little known sequel, As Bad As It Could Possibly Be. That's a, that's a soul crusher. Restart me. Okay. The run was not bad. I I take responsibility for that one, man. Um, there's a couple of things we could have done. We could have taken the poop brim, or we could have rolled it. It wasn't the right play to roll it right away, but it could have changed the outcome. Hey, you know, you gotta you gotta separate in your life. I mean, I, I feel like you gotta recognize there are times you'll do the right decision and things won't work out well. You know, you, you make an informed decision, you weigh your options, you roll the dice on the sensible decision and it doesn't work out. It happens. Sometimes you make the right decision and it doesn't work. Sometimes you make the wrong decision and it turns out beautifully. I think on that run, we made the right decisions and then they didn't turn out. So be it. We don't, we don't pick up the coins. I, look, the, the seed is plausible, but we didn't lose on that run because of the, because we picked up a consumable. So I, I think it solves a problem we have yet to face. Also, it introduces a problem that I don't want to face, which is uh, having people sarcastically be like, you know, well, yeah, but you use the seed. <laughs> oh. I'd rather, I, you know, we're gonna do it. Like, don't even sweat. We, again, I, I try to pass on this generation not just to the younger audience, but to my peers. Oh, I picked up a coin. <laughs> to my peers as well. You face a little bit of strife. Keep going, you know? Losing once or twice does not mean you need to use a cheat code. If you wanna, you can, but like, get out of here telling me to use that rhetoric. I, I, can, I can weather the storm of the, the slings and arrows of some difficulty. Why play on hard mode though? It's just, you know, what I'm used to. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep doing it. Everyone's gangsta till greed spawns a coin right in front of you. That, that's what I'm afraid of. Is like needing a key to open a planetarium or something like that. And then the planetarium... Uh, or not the planetarium, but uh, opening a chest to try to get a key. And then it spawns like a bomb right in front of a door or something like that. And then I'm like, well, it is what it is. This room is uh, a little nasty, huh? So anyway, long story short, yeah, we'll be uh, we'll be returning to Pokemon Unite at some point. I did. I, I mean, Dan played a bunch today and and enjoyed it as well. This room is a freak, man. It's a little freak. Just bomb things out of the way? Is this, uh, it, it might be the best bait in Twitch chat history. But at the risk of being baited, <clears throat> how, 
how am I supposed to get a bomb to bomb stuff out of the way if I'm not allowed to pick up bombs? Hey, that's pretty. Oh, I was gonna say it's pretty good, but then I'm like, uh, maybe not, because <laughs> I don't want what's gonna show up in the average secret room anyway. Hey, can you do the other attack for a second? I'd just like to do some damage to you. Thank you. Worth a look. We're gonna have a reroll for the boss item. Yeah, 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 yeah. Have you listened to the new Modest Mouse? I, I need a, like a chat command, and it's not meant to be negative, but the chat command is if the album is not by Steely Dan, I have not listened to it and have no plans to. If the album is not called Asia or Gra uh, Gaucho by Steely Dan, then I have not listened to it. Don't make me tap the sign. <laughs> that being said, I have listened to some new music lately. Um, maybe you've heard of it. It's, it's, it's a little bit of... It's, it's hip-hop, so it's gotta be new. Um, it's uh, a little band called The Far Side. Little song called Passer Me By. It's a classic. So, this is an orbital. I think we take and get out. And you know what I'm gonna do? Just, just to be safe. I think this is a genius idea in chat. Now the coin has been erased. We don't have to worry about it anymore. <laughs> Yoink. Reduced to atoms. Billy Mays here, there you go. It's your idea. Bruh. Corey, are you are you seeing this? We've we've done some incredible stuff in Isaac today, Corey. Don't pick up the bomb. Hold on, I gotta check. I got some push notifications. Yo, Kate, let's go. Oh no, Corey, you just gotta. Are you sure you wanna advertise this here, Corey? You just got a call from the Canadian Tax Authority. Is this like, boy, uh, are my arms tired or something? It's like a call from. Oh no. <laughs> I got a call from the Canadian Tax Authority asking if they received my letter that they sent on June 18th. That's like the most anxiety spiking question I feel like you could be asked. Because now you've also got like... First off, you're like, I got a call from CRA. Anxiety spiked. The call is because... Uh, we sent you a letter and you haven't replied to it yet, and I didn't get the letter. You're like, okay, so maybe it's something like that needs to be responded to. Oh, oh, GST, HST. All right, Corey, you honestly like my my two cents. I've I've been through this way back in the day in like 2014, 2015. I received many uh, patronizing calls from the the Canada Revenue Agency regarding a, a similar issue. I think you're gonna be okay. They called back to tell me I'm I'm fine. Isn't that like a Paul Simon lyric? And she calls back to tell me I'm fine. As if I didn't know that. It's called a Graceland. Best album, 1986. Um. I've, I've had that before where, like... I... No, like, okay, here's a... Portal can erase consumables. 
But like, I, I think that we can do better. It serving a function doesn't mean it gets a spot on my Noah's Ark of items. So I need, I need, I, I, we we can do better than that. And if it disappears, then it disappears. So be it. Plus one. Yo, 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 yo. Oh fuck. <laughs> Uh, that's, he will never get this, and then uh, one day uh, he got it. Yeah, Corey, that was my experience. Like, I, you know, it's a different world now than it was in 2014. So this bit is about to go over like a lead balloon. But I remember I got a very anxiety-inducing phone call as a younger man that was like, uh, you know, from a, a, a nice, polite lady at the CRA who didn't know what my job was, and she was like. A little patronizing she's like you know how often are you supposed to pay taxes and i'm like every year um but i i had to like i was trying to explain that she's like what you you were like a website administrator and i was like not nah, really like in the web like i i felt like trying to explain the job like the uh the guy in office space right like i'm a people person i was she's like well you make money on the internet but like you don't sell anything and I was like yes you got it and she's like that doesn't make sense to me so I'm just gonna like send you uh, this like GST HST file and you can just like get your accountant to like fill it out as they see fit and I'm like okay fine so that's what we've been doing for like you know eight years or something okay take me down <clears throat> My job is tables? Yeah, don't ask about the tables. I, d I do assume that whenever I fill out anything like that, like whenever I say, like, I'm an internet broadcaster, I always assume that they're like, they, is they think that I'm an adult film star, which is a little flattering, but unfortunately false. Those those uh, jobs never called me back uh, once they saw my headshot. <laughs> Unfortunately, and uh, that's not to say anything about the body shot. But um, <laughs> they don't even get me started uh, on the money shot. <laughs> Collar buttoned up to the top, go like this. It's like oh. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> this is what happens when you have a, a five hour long stream that's like three Isaac runs. You start to lose your damn mind. I'm starting to think I might need a license to make toast in my own damn toaster. That's how that's how zooted I am right now. Off the adrenaline. Don't pick up the consumable. No consumable, please. Are you excited to do normal Isaac runs? Yes. Like, I'm so... That, that's why I, I looked at the ledger of things left to do today. And I, uh, I said to myself, we can knock this out today and get to, uh, get to complete safety. Hello. Oh, of course. Do you think that the, the cloth helped? She's so happy now. Before she was going crazy. Now she's like, hey. Hey. She's like, my dad's a little weird. <laughs> Hi. What which song? Oh, and I was like, uh, I have to erase you like I should. <laughs> I'm gonna erase you. That was that was uh, the most adrenaline I've felt in my entire life, I think. So I was watching your last play. What was, yeah. Why was, was there so many moves? It was, uh, the last run was a challenge where you could get inside of the walls of the, of the rooms. 
So every floor was 13 rooms by 13 rooms. So it's like almost 200 rooms per floor of stuff. And but if you explore them all, like which you're, but in order to be able to do that, I basically had to hit like a, a one in a hundred shot, and and did it uh, for the third times out of four attempts. <laughs> oh, 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 um, well, it's hard because normally after you go through like 20 rooms, it spawns a, a ghost that basically one taps you but I just erased the ghost from existence reduced to atoms okay I I would describe myself as a ghostbuster my wife got me a chicken board here chicken board here with curly fries this is an incredible day oh well but by all means not asked for, by the way. Remember? You know what I'm talking about? It's a ninja tweet. It's a... Uh, right. <laughs> Thank you. Not asked for? Dude, that's a pretty good trinket, too. Uh, that's not a great item for us. <laughs> I wish that you would knock that shit off immediately. Um, next, go down to the next floor. So cursed, man. Okay. Yeah, remember, we gotta beat the lamb. I know we're doing something right, because now people are like, they're, they're reminding me about the negative. Okay, that's where... That's not so bad. That's range and evil. Ooh, board gear. I'm, I'm feeling mighty silly, man. TGIF. Thursday got it trending. T Thursday got it funky. There's a good joke. I'm gonna put that in my joke moleskin. Say TGIF on Thursday, and then when people go, uh, it's Thursday, go, yeah, Thursday got it funky. Thursday gets it funky. That Malf would love that joke, man. Malf would, he would use that himself, I think. It's an incredible trinket. <laughs> Sounds like a chib joke. My One of my favorite genre of chib joke is when he changes his New Zealand accent to uh, like a British accent and then says something out of character. But because I'm from North America, it sounds like exactly the same to me. So I just think he's saying some strange stuff. Plus two? That's not a joke. I'm being highly sincere right now. <laughs> I've never been more sincere about anything in my in my damn life, man. Old bandage. Really funny joke. Uh, thanks for the HP. I'm not even going to the item room because not because I think we're too strong, but because I uh, want to not pick up consumables. So the faster I can get a chance to complete the run, the better off we're gonna be. Chib's $35 million house tour react was really good. I didn't see it, but I did see his Twitter clip where the, the old guy says, you know, check this out. It's the first time I've ever stepped on real grass. And then he takes a step. And I'm like, the guy is genuinely in his long life. He has never stepped on real grass. Is that even possible? That house was $500 million. <laughs> oh my god. It was 100,000 square feet. Hey, that's only $5,000 a square foot. That's a bargain, man. What the heck's go- Oh, I see. By the way, immediately upon doing that math, my brain just went, eh, I don't think that's right at all, but I just, uh... Uh, it, it's already been, it's slipped through my memory already. Okay, I'm reminding myself, no uh, consumables except keys. <laughs> Depths one. 
I do love like two tapping these bosses. Normally you would just float over those keys, man. You'd be loving it. You would float over those coins, you'd be loving it, man. HP and trinket, not really that necessary. Okay. I need to see what you do. You look like the album cover, Tears for Fears song from the big chair. I'm looking the item up to make my own decision. You gain two familiar demons that stay by Isaac's side and fire shots. They deal 40% of Isaac's damage and scale with you. Okay, so it just seems like obviously definitely great. Yoink. Yo! What'd you type into Google? I go to Platinum God and then I just find the picture that matches up with it. Because Platinum God is like the most UX friendly wiki that's ever existed. And it doesn't constantly serve you like uh, in-stream advertisements over and over. Which is, uh, dare I say, Poggy. Thank you, Iluk. Now, I, I love where we're at on this run. The only thing I'm going to say... I feel skeptical as of right now that we beat the lamb. But we have some time to go before like the lamb doesn't spawn on this floor. So we got a little time. How much to embed your stream? I think it should be the opposite. Oh, I see. That's what you mean. Good joke, Luke. The price just doubled. Slash marker. It's the key one. All right, we're gonna run it back. I don't have to go to the bathroom. I don't. I'm not owned. I'm. I don't. My bladder's not full of pee. My bladder's not full of pee. Ooh, well, you can take runes. You can take runes. I don't know if you can take batteries though, but you can definitely take runes. Bro, explain? What do you mean? Ex explain what? There's no words on it. What does that mean? Can I tell you as well? Oh, man, I'm so excited. Kate said she got me a chicken burger plus curly fries. Curly fries gotta be just about the most underrated fry in existence. Somebody told me, I don't know if they were in chat, but they told me that the reason all curly fries taste the same is there's like one curly fry supplier in North America. Like, I don't know, it's like a secret herbs and spices sort of thing. Curly fries are mediocre. It's a... Uh, Congratulations, what you have just said is the single dumbest thing I've ever heard in my entire life. Everyone here is stupider for having heard it. You are awarded no points and may God have mercy on your soul. Billy Madison, 1995. Maybe, maybe underrated was not the right way to describe it, but underserved. Like, straight cut french fries are everywhere. Sweet potato fries, pretty common now. You see wedges. Waffle fries are another rare one. I gotta imagine that, you know, you, you need a special machine to cut them. But I feel like you don't see that many curlies. Not where I'm from. Guacamole, my curly fries. They don't make these shit swear I'm from. <laughs> just, just get it over with. Just hit me with the minus twos. Just, just do it. I deserve it. For, plus, uh, no, no, come on. Plus twos? Oh, come on. They love me. They really love me. I should not... Hold on. This is not how you play the game. You you get the devil deal first for reroll potential. Here's your th sympathy plus two. That's Iggy Azalea. First things first. I'm the realist. Drop the base, let the whole place fill this. 
and I'm still in the murder business, I can hold you down like I'm teaching lessons in physics? You should want a bad bitch like me. Like this. Drop it something, 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 just like this. Cup of gray, cup of goose, cup of Chris. Cup of, uh, cup of with, with a bit on my wrist, on my wrist. Take the whole drink straight and never chase that. Drop top like we bring in 88 back. And I ain't turned down nothing. <laughs> Straight from the gut, and I'm so fancy. You already know. Now that's. Bro, you're gonna get me in trouble here. You're gonna get me DMCA'd. When's the new uh, Iggy Azalea dropping? Everyone's talking about the new Kanye. Ratioed plus. Don't care, plus you fell off. I'm into gangster rap, like Iggy Azalea. Maybe I do this. I thought that you knew this or something. Or so, uh, well, you do that, do that. <laughs> Who that, do that, that do that, do that. My name's EGGY, got my name in gold. I've been something, something, something with my something. Uh, lost in the banter. I, I'm not, I mean, the run is, uh, we need something a little stronger to start with here. That's what I'm saying, man. Yeah, I kind of love bad hip-hop, to be honest. Like, I, I love good hip-hop, but um, I also like a lot of, like, really, like, garbage hip-hop. The only thing is, I can't tell you what songs they are, because you'll probably like them. This seems like a, an interesting synergy here. Like, like, Riding Dirty by uh, Chameleonaire? Like, that song sucks, man. That's a bad song. But when I tell you it's a bad song, you're going to be like, it's a classic. It's not a classic. It's kind of horrible. But I like it. He's going to poop some drops and ruin your run? Nah, man, he's just going to like eat the lamb. That's what I'm telling myself. I think he's just going to eat the lamb straight up. Do you know any Pitbull lyrics? I'm gonna be real with you. I don't, and I'm being completely serious. I don't think I have heard a Pitbull song outside of the context of, there, there's two contexts. One is at a Vancouver Canucks game in between like a meaningless face-off in the second period. They will play uh, Timber sometimes. And then also when I was training for Champions of Fire 2, Beat Fever had Firework as a song. So I know the one that goes... This is... You You suck. You're a piece of garbage. Like... I'm, I'm giving it my damn all. No. I'm, uh, incredible. This man is too angry to die. Nah, just take me. <laughs> I was too angry to die, and then I looked at his health bar, and I went, eh. Nothing will hit you like a, like a first floor boss, man. The spiders? Like, really? Like, we have to... We have to do... Come on, man. Come on, man. I will become back my money. You just wait. Like, this is our last real chance, because pretty soon we're going to have that boar gear. The curly fries. The rest of the episode is just going to be, like, essentially hell for anybody that has, like, um, whatever that... Uh, condition is that makes... Uh, misphonia? Is that it? It's, it's going to be combination ASMR and uh, miso, misophonia. Not easily offended. I, you know, it probably doesn't ruin it, but why not? Did I tell you, by the way, that like I... Uh, I was on uh, Twitch 
And after like 9 p.m., almost nobody I follow is live. And the ones that I do follow that are live are sometimes playing stuff I'm not that interested in watching. Uh, so I went to the Twitch homepage, and it hit me with an ASMR channel. And I just watched, I know this is going to seem like, you know, bonk, but I just watched out of, like, human interest, right? Because it's just su such a different part of the website than <laughs> what I create. I create stuff that is an assault on the ears. It's loud, it's quiet, it's off-key. We're going... <laughs> we're eating directly into the microphone, and then people are like, you know... I can't believe he would eat in the microphone. And then with the, like, breadcrumbs spewing out of my mouth, I'm like, fuck you, get out of here. It's it's nasty, man. Like, it's disgusting, and it's just the way I like it. Um, but now, I think that because of the machine learning at the Twitch homepage, they, uh, they feed me ASMR every time I go to the uh, homepage. I should re... No, it's better to try to kill you, because then we get, like, two shots at, a, at gas, like meat or magic mush. But, um... I, uh... So now, it, it just... It's rude to say, but can I just say, like, it makes me laugh that there's a chat alongside the ASMR? Like, ASMR is one thing, but the fact that there's, like, a live audience that comments upon it is is so bizarre to me. <laughs> I was watching this, you know, they've all got the ear microphones and stuff, and there was a... The lady was just going... Like, slurping up the ears and stuff like that, and then in chat, people were like, uh, Hey, did anybody see the finale of Loki, and I was just like, what are you... <laughs> it's just... I don't know what to say. Like, it's so good. Well... Wow, Loki. I'm not anti-ASMR. I really, like, I don't care. Quite frankly. I don't mean that in a negative way. I mean, like, you know, as far as I'm concerned, it's like the Wild West on this website. You know, if you listen to a song, they're going to send you to prison. But, like, anything else, I guess, is fair game. So I'm not going to be mad at ASMR or, like, hot tubs or whatever. But it's, it's just a very funny concept to me. It's like, oh, I'm home from work. I'm going to listen to somebody, like, you know, pretend to lick my ear for eight hours. Maybe I'll catch up with some of the regulars in chat on what they've been watching on Netflix lately. One of the VTubers did cursed ASMR and put her microphone inside of a blender. That's a great bit, man. That's a, that's an incredible bit. I, su I support that. See, I can say positive things about, you know, hobbies and parts of the medium that I'm not necessarily related to. Wait until you see shrimp 24-7 chat. I'll take it, man. What the heck is... Is, is Shrimp 24-7 exactly what it sounds like? Just the chat where you... There's, like, shrimp hanging out? Yep. All right. Well, cool. That's... Sounds pog. Coin came with the run. The coin came with the run. No, this is that's not a question that's like un, unfair to ask. This is not my final Isaac stream ever. In fact, this is I guess I haven't talked about it. This is like just the end of the stuff that you gotta knock off the to-do list. Once the to-do list stuff is is done, we have a blank canvas, also known as a tabula rasa. Uh, and I, I honestly think there's a number of things you could do with that. One of which is, you know, all character random streaks. Uh, but I think I would like to... I want to do, like, one serious streak before my neuroplasticity decays past the point of no return. Um, I, I want to, like, try to play a little Isaac every week and build up something crazy, man. 
Like, b build up. If I could get a triple digit repentance streak, I think I could, you know, die hopefully half a century from now with like a twinkle in my eye. So that's, that's on my list for sure. Definitely low on the list is save file two. We'll save that for when the analytics start to flag a little bit. <laughs> I'm not joking. Uh, oh! Watch out. What? <laughs> I'm kicking my ass. Do you mind? That's a really... That, honestly, you got to give it to, up to Hot there. That was a, a huge read. He got me right in the corner. Dude, I, after we get all this stuff, dude, to item description mod, I know I could probably put it on right now, but... Oh, man. He showed up. He just wanted it more. Hey, tell us what you were thinking there when you got hit by that brimstone beam. Yeah, you know, I, I, I knew that I had to watch out for it. We, we watched the game footage on the hunt. You know, we played together in this league for a long time. You know, we both know each other really well. I knew that that's the brimstone beam. It's, it's what you got to watch out for. I mean, he's a talented boss. There's a reason when people talk about first floor bosses, the haunt's one of those names that always comes up as scary. Just thought I'd give it 110%. You know, today things didn't go my way. We're going to have a hard practice tomorrow. Bag skate, throwing up in trash cans. And, you know, if we meet him in the playoffs, we'll hope to get our revenge. Next question. <laughs> I love sports, man. That's why I'm so pissed off Naomi Osaka deprived us of all those great interviews. By pretending to be sad for attention, apparently, I guess, is the way that people feel about that if they are uh, stupid. I've never seen so many plus twos. Let's freaking go, man. Keep them rolling. Remember, we went blues? Honestly, it, if I thought it wouldn't get the... M it probably wouldn't get the MCA. It's... Oh, anonymous gifter. Thank you for gifting five subs to the community. Thank you. I feel like, um... We went blues might be one of the funniest sports things that's ever happened. Nobody in the history... Ever thought that this day would ever end? Well, guess what? It makes me laugh just thinking about the way he sticks his tongue out. It's not gonna end. Oh, man. Oh, uh, sports. Anyway, yeah. I'm excited. I hope that, you know, we're pretty well vaccinated up here. I'm, I'm hoping in the fall season numbers stay low. Maybe we can actually go see like a Canucks game this year. I'm, I'm stoked for the Kraken rivalry, man. I, w I would love to see some Canucks v Kraken games. Like the Kraken, I'm, in, I'm enjoying the fact that like right now it's all like fun and games. Probably in like 10 years when they win a Stanley Cup before my favorite team, I'll be like, I hate you. But for now, I'm like, dude, I should get like an Eberly jersey or something. For now, I'm like, it's, it's all fun. No, I don't think... Uh, I, I'll just be honest with you. I don't really like the Summer Olympics. I don't like watching them. Uh, I The Winter Olympics... I'll watch just about anything if it's on in my, like, time zone. The the Summer Olympics, you know, occasionally I, I enjoy watching them, but just, a, like, a lot, of, a lot of running, which I don't find that compelling to watch. A lot of swimming. Also, I'm trying to think of... Actually, I think the time zone is pretty good for Pacific, now that I think about it. Like, Japan and Vancouver are, like, 14 hours offset, which seems bad, but is actually kind of just, like, you just flip the day.
Okay. This this is the run. Don't touch it. Don't uh, don't touch it. Don't touch it. Jacob doesn't touch it. T uh, these are not that good. Money equals power is tempting. These are also not that good. Um, full stop. I guess we take betrayal. Edmund. <clears throat> you have made a shit of peace. You little fricker. You made a shit of peace with your trash Isaac. It's freaking bad, this trash game. I will become back my money. I hope you will in your next time. A cow on a trash farm, you sucker. Okay. Now that we got that rage out of our system. We will hold R and try again. <laughs> toxic, toxic. Hunger Games? No oh, thanks. I'm still full. I, I was trying to figure out how to watch Eric Andre show episodes in Canada. I have Adult Swim. Is anybody out there like a tech-savvy grandson that I could I could ask this question to? Anyway, I was watching clips on YouTube when it gets me so good when he is wearing the sunglasses and holding the cane. And then he goes, excuse me, miss, have you seen my dog? And she goes, yeah. And then he pulls off his sunglasses and they've like made his eyes look like they've got skin over top of them. And he goes... Describe him to me! And she runs away. <laughs> it's so... Oh, man. Well, when we get perfection, this is gonna pop. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah, we don't have Hulu up here. I don't know what... Anything that's on Hulu, it's just a... It, like, it's a free-for-all. I don't know where the hell that stuff exists. Yeah, so this is, it's the key. It's the key, you can pick up only keys. You start with a coin as the loss. That's your thing, you start with the coin. Tainted loss doesn't get the D1, they get the Eternal D6, uh, which is a two room charge D6, but a 50% chance for the item pedestals that are rerolled to disappear. And now we're all on the same page. This isn't tainted lost. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm, I my brain has. I I can feel that is like dry up there. There's like nothing. No electricity is being conducted. Just a couple of neurons manually delivering packets. I'm I'm doing my best here. My brain is fully in curly fry territory. The brain brain juice has run out after the the red room run but we're gonna get there man we're gonna I, I i believe we will finish maybe not on this run hmm but i believe we will do it today old bandage funny joke see you in hell yeah plus i mean plus we're almost uh, like done here tgif baby f yeah thursday got it funky <laughs> Tier size, honestly, like we shouldn't, but it's kind of fun. I rerolled my last run because we accidentally picked up. You're a son of a gun. I accidentally picked up a spirit heart via. I, I popped Mr. Dolly, then walked into a. Uh, Devil room, when I exited the room, the spirit heart was right there. Couldn't avoid it, thus nullifying our challenge. I mean, when you die to the Widow, you can't really put that on Edmund. That one, that one's kind of on me. Let's get those neurons going, man. I will become back, my spider.
I don't know if you can pick up a charged key, but I bet you can. He's thinking about that board here. Man, you got me right. I'm thinking about You got me dead to rights, man. I'm thinking about that chicken board here. I did, you know what's messed up? I didn't even know I was going to get one. But the excitement has now worn off. And, uh, and this is not good. Because now I'm like, what the hell is taking so long? It's really, it says something about the human mind. Or at least my human mind. That it was a chicken board gear not asked for. I was so happy when I knew that it was coming. And now that it's taken a little longer than I expected, I'm like, this is an outrage. Come on, bro. That was on me. I was, I was not glancing. I was glancing at the game and reading chat fully. Owens. Not a good item. Much better. Much better. I don't know if you can pick up a charged key. I'm pretty sure you probably can. It's also why other people's cooking tastes better than your own. Because when you cook, you build up the anticipation and then it's it can never live up to it. I, I'm, gonna, I'm willing to take issue with that. I feel like I judge my own food as better than... Not chefs. Like, if I'm at a restaurant, I'm, like, incepted to believe that the food is always good. Just due to context clues and, like, priming. Um, but when I cook, like, versus, let's say, like, my, my mom cooks me a meal, I think I judge her food more harshly than I judge my own. <laughs> I think I make, I'm an easy critic for myself. I do also cook to my own taste, it's absolutely true. Don't get me wrong, I'm also like, hey mom, thanks for the free meal. Saved me a lot of time. Oh, another lobster wellington you shouldn't have. Don't talk to me about the salmon nachos. That was that came together under duress. That was not that was like a chopped situation. That was that was not a situation where I went into it with a recipe and said I'm going to make something delicious. That was a situation where everything fell apart. Oh, another sloppy steak. Don't mind if I do. Please, guys, no sloppy steaks. Hey, come on. I'm a nice guy. We're nice guys here. We're not going to slop them up. Nope. F. <laughs> you missed another coin? Yeah, that's correct. I, I hope to repeat that um, myriad times over the course of this episode. If possible. Dude, you notice what uh, Tim Robinson's wearing in the table sketch, by the way? You know what he's wearing? Polo shirt buttoned up to the top. Am I right or am I right? He's a teacher. Yeah, exactly. Polo shirt, silk polo shirt tucked into some gray slacks, buttoned up to the top. Looks good, man. It's a good look. They're, they're stanzos. They're nice. What's the worst season to sketch? It's a good question. Credit card roulette is, is not good. Um... I haven't seen enough of season two enough times. I've seen one episode like seven times, the rest like twice. Yeah, I think Little Bob Boys is kind of garbage. I, I'm i with you. I, I'm not a big Tammy Craps guy either. Calico cut pants a little long. Coffin flop? Hey, come on. Coffin flop is a... Uh, that's a... Uh, that's an incredible sketch.
Bad eye. Tammy Craps is S tier? I don't think so. I, dis I disagree markedly with your reasoning. Hey, TC Tugger, that's that's a good sketch. You just you probably just don't get it, man. You probably just don't understand all the cerebral humor. Like how bad is River Mountain High doing in the ratings that they have to run like an 8 minute long sponsored bit for a t-shirt in the middle of the episode? Like that's the stuff that gets me it gets me thinking. Okay, take a, take a second to think about it. There's a chance, man. There's a chance. Can this run do it? Yeah. Yeah. We got two damage upgrades, and our tiers are freaking enormous. Brain, I'm gonna need you. I know you don't have a whole lot of juice left in there. Um, I'm gonna need you to do this, okay? I'm gonna need you to hold this one together till our next devil deal. Uh, or angel deal, at which point you're gonna give me some great stuff and I'm gonna win the game. Office Beach Party's bad? I don't know, I think Office Beach Party's pretty funny. I like that one. I will say, <laughs> we can take runes. I will say, there are, oh, that was so close. Maybe a few too many sketches, and I think you should leave that take place in a boardroom where some misconduct happens, but <laughs> apart from that, I'm, I'm invested. Anyway, that's enough about I think you should leave. I know there's no other media to discuss now while we wait for Phase 4 of the Marvel Cinematic Universe to play out, but we gotta find something, man. Favorite Seinfeld episode. Have we talked about the one where they ride the Sibian? I, I, I'll, Baron, dude, that would make a great Mandela effect post. Seinfeld episode where they ride the Sibian? <laughs> I swore as a teenager, I saw an episode where George, Jerry, Elaine, and Kramer went on the Howard Stern show and they rode the Sibian and the one who went the longest without achieving orgasm was awarded a thousand dollars. I have a vivid memory of this taking place. And yet, I can't find it in any episode listings. Is it possible that after the 2016 election, we slipped into a pocket dimension where this episode doesn't exist, but everything else is unchanged? I don't know. Would really love to hear people's opinions on this. Okay. Let's do it. Deal with the angel. 17% chance. One in 6.73 repeating, of course. Just chilling. This is a heavy copium, heavy copium. But that's okay, it's only, it's only, it, it just says, Pium on the air tank. We don't know if it's hopium or copium until we see what we get here. I couldn't say it's opium because that's, I mean, a real drug. Here we go. It was, it was, it was copium the whole time. I want this. We got 20 minutes. Maybe it's just plum, man. There should be more uh, gaseous uh, products, IMO. 
I mean, they're, they're, don't get me wrong, you know, there's like propane and butane and stuff like that. Which I'm now hoping are gaseous and not liquid, but I don't think that's the case at all. But like, you know what I mean? Like, if we're talking about things that you like buy to eat... I almost never buy a gas to eat it, you know? A lot of solids, decent amount of liquids, almost no gases. What if, what if you could go to like 7-Eleven and just buy a can of like good smells? Like a surprise, a surprise can? And you like crack it open and you're like, oh my god, is that like fresh cheddar cheese curds? And then there could be like rare smells as well, like leg one of one smells. We could be, uh, dude, that's the thing, we could get this shit all sorted out on the blockchain. What am I thinking? Algis, huh? Yera, huh? Okay. All right, cool. Uh, Devil Deal? Nope. NL, are you okay? Not, uh, really. Uh, I'm doing well, but I, I feel my brain is like, it's just barely holding it together, man. You know, like that poster of the cat, and it's like clinging onto the rope, and it says, hang in there? Like, that's my last neuron. Just, just begging for basically brimstone or godhead or something and then to just maintain the highest degree of focus necessary to not accidentally pick up a coin. I'm telling you, man, NFT smells. It's the wave of the future. You're all laughed at me. It's not how you speak in English. You all laughed at me, but you know what? Everybody laughed at Neil Armstrong too until he went to the moon. Don't touch this. I like collared shirt meta. Oh, thank you. Nobody laughed at him. He was a highly respected Air Force pilot. Oh, I guarantee you people were laughing. Behind his back. Hey, look at this guy. <laughs> he's gonna... He's gonna do... Why don't you go to the moon, uh, Marvin the Martian? Why don't you go to the moon? All right, whatever, moon man. I bet they were going like that all the time. It really got him, too. Until one day... He got to the moon. And then, you know, all those people that were making fun of him? They weren't laughing so hard anymore. And even if they were, he couldn't hear them, because he was on the moon. What is this item? I'm still on Platinum God. I'm searching. I'm searching. <laughs> what, what are you? Are you? I'm just going to steal this one straight from chat. It's purgatory. Oh, it's the one where you step on the cracks, right? Yeah, yeah, I can live with that. Then he punched them? No, that was Buzz Aldrin. Nobody laughed at him. Unless they wanted to get their ass beat. Oh. Alright. Seems a little complicated, but that's okay. Don't, don't pick it up, don't pick it up, don't pick it up, don't be, you can pick this up, you can chill here. Very DAE item. I don't think it's that DAE, like for the scope of Isaac, step on the thing to do damage, that's not so bad, man. What does it ends today mean? It's about love, it's not about repentance, it's about family. Family means never having to say, you're pogged. Soul of Cain <laughs> opens red rooms. Okay, we've learned something here today. Wow. Mission failed. Hey 
everybody, welcome to the It's the Key Challenge. Very excited today. On It's the Key, you don't pick up. Okay, that's I'm not continuing the bit, but you, you get the idea. Azazel's the way. Please just be tainted, Kane. I feel like you're Beelzebub. I will not play as tainted Kane on this. The challenge already s sucks big time. You can whisper your sweet temptations into my ear. Just be Tainted Cane. It'll be fun and easy. I doubt it, man. Hey, the medicine tastes bad. Why not wash it down with some motor oil? That's that's what. We, here's what we're gonna we're gonna do, okay? What we're gonna do is so simple. First off, we're getting the free item from the Fool card. We're not gonna worry about Devil Deals. We're gonna get Angel Deals instead. Angel deals are gonna pop like crate. Hey everybody, welcome back. It's the key, baby. I know what you're thinking. 0% chance this guy makes this happen. That's when I do my best work. When it's literally impossible to not beat someone's expectations. <laughs> Now we have the ability to blow things up, which is worth something. Watch him nail it first try. Yeah, yeah, first try. Yeah, I like the sound of that. That sounds good to me. Don't pick it up. Oh, you temptress. Absolutely not. Although, oh, I was like, we could blow it up and then get some money out of the pots. No, Satan. What the heck is that? You get no other spacebar items. Times two. I can take a trinket. No. Not that one. You can get health ups from items, you just can't get, like, spirit arts. I don't think, um... I don't think Book of Revelations is gonna do it for us here. I I would like to see what's in there, but I don't know. I right, gotta put a run in here. Just hold R? What are you talking about? This run's good. This, this is a good run. It's a perfectly cromulent run. Look, whether or not Tick's good, like, it still has to be held, right? Like, you, you can only get rid of it via the matchstick? That, in and of itself, makes it kind of stinky. Forget that, man. Give me this. No, that's stupid. Give me this. That's the play. It's perfectly cromulent. I really don't want to have this hanging over my head for another day. Just be smart. Take this in for a potential per throw. I wonder how Tainted Blue Baby would work for this run. I think you would just like definitely lose. Because if you picked up poops, you, you, you're done. Then we don't go in... Yeah, screw it, man. Don't even... Just get down there. Good stuff. This is... This is doable. Oh. I thought I could see what was in there. That was weird. I think I'm losing uh, my mind. This is the run, no copium. You know what? I needed that. We're going angel meta, that's why we didn't go to the deal with the devil. Jacob doesn't touch it. The visual, visual hallucinations have started. This is the symptoms of uh, boar gear deficiency. If I hadn't known that a boar gear was en route, I would be like... I wouldn't even be noticing, man. 
But now that I know that there's like a boar gear in the other room and I'm not eating it right now, my brain is like, it can't even... It can't even form a single coherent thought. Thank you. Could be planetariums now, too. That's, dude, when we get perfection, this is gonna pop. Just got a tactical glances. I live my life glancing. We just gotta make sure we're doing it at the exact right time. The wrong time is the wrong time. Potentially catastrophic. Angel deals. Oh, you are, uh... <laughs> George is getting upset. It is, uh, you know... Instant mom and mom's hard kill is... Is enough for me to get rid of Anarchist Cookbook at least, but... It's not like we can use bombs to do anything anyway, you know? Oh, open a secret room. Don't pick up anything. Uh, oh, blow up a tinted rock. Don't pick up anything. Except maybe small rock. I guess that would have been pretty sick, actually, now that I think about it. Now we're talking. One of these, one of these. I forgot I'm not the lost, so that's not that big of a deal. Hey, we... Dude, at least when the run, like, gets hit a little bit, it's not toasted. Toasted. I, I was almost like, dude, a nickel. Amazing. Incredible. Thank you, Eddie. Thanks for the stimmy. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Sorry, every third item in the game is HP, so I'm not sw <laughs> Well played. Now. The first little bit of hope has entered the ecosystem. Blink. Very nice. I, I check my consumables, like, literally every room. Because I'm like, it's, I'm scared. <gasps> you know what I'm so scared of? Is actually fighting, like, Bombino. I'll take a tears up. I, I can't reroll it anyway. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm scared of fighting Bombino. Doesn't he, like, spit out coins or something? Okay, no autopilot glances. Also got to be careful going to these rooms. Keep in mind, you can't get more spirit hearts uh, except via items. So ev every little bit of HP is super precious, which is a little spooky as a Zazel. You can definitely take a key. You could open that for three flies. Would not recommend. Dude, if we can, if we can become Guppy... Oh, if we can get nine lives... Now, once you start talking about items instead of, like, you know, the best Madonna song. Which is probably, in my opinion, Ray of Light, by the way. That's how you know you're getting serious. This floor is 20% planetarium chance. Thank you, thank you. Like a prayer? I do like like a prayer as well. I'll, I'll give you an honorable mention for that one. Hung up is underrated. I mean, I think Madonna is underrated lately as well, just because of the fact that uh, people don't like her as a, <laughs> a person, <laughs> or they find her at least insufferable. Um, but musically, she has some, yeah, you know, she's not like one of my favorite artists of all time, but she has some bops, man. Also did bizarrely adopt an English accent. But, you know, it happens. Squeezy, but don't pick them. Don't pick them. You, you, you can go in here without compromising your angel chance anyway.
Okay, don't pick up the consumables. Just go to, find your planetarium. How do you know her? She's not in Steely Dan. Um, she could be if she auditioned. Michael McDonald doesn't tour with them anymore. So they, they need somebody that can go, Pig! And I think that she can totally... She'd probably make it like more about her, which is maybe not what they're looking for, but... I'm just focusing everyone. I need to refocus myself now and then. Can he pick up red hearts? And no, like, oh, I mean, I can, but it'll ruin the challenge. But I, may I pick up red hearts? <laughs> Weep, boop, bleep, boop, boop, burder, burder, boop. What's your favorite foreign movie? Uh, I'm Canadian, so my favorite foreign movie is Jurassic Park. Avengers Endgame definitely up there as well. <laughs> There's a lot of them. You're really spoiled for choice. They make a lot of great foreign movies. America has a strong uh, cinematic history. It's not only Canada that makes good films, like the Resident Evil franchise. We got a problem here, man. I'm realizing, like... We uh, have no HP. This would be a really convenient time to beat the odds, get an unbelievable deal with the Angel, like a Holy Mantle tier item. We're not in a winning position right now, but I will say I don't think we're that far out. Is that the dictionary definition of copium? Perhaps. Yes. Can you get the quarter without compromising the challenge? I think you can. But I also don't know how you get it. You gotta take this. And then... I mean, there's some good stuff here, but it's definitely not worth doing all of Boss Rush. If I still have my Fool card, I might be persuaded. <laughs> little, little spicy, but... Get frozen. Yo, okay. All right. I, I mean, like, just to be straight up with you, it's completely plausible that if we... Now, and this is the, the hopium is getting out of control. But it's completely plausible, I think, that when we get to the lamb floor, there'll be all sorts of of great deals with the devil that we could take that could nullify our existing need for HP. Unfortunately, in order for that to work, we gotta take like zero damage on a route. So there is that. That's not easy. But hey man, maybe it is easy when you're built different. Can't wait till we get to the dark room. Yeah, oh, you... <laughs> You know is common. Oh. Let's go back for those keys. Yeah, it turns out if you take no damage, you win. As long as you're also moving. Come on, man. Just give me a... Well, actually, you know what? Don't give me a nod leaf. I think I'm already going to be a little late. So don't give me Nod Leaf. But do give me an Angel Deal here. Lovely. Lovely boss fight. Why fight the boss when the boss will do it itself, mate? By the way, Magic Scab, thanks for the extra one hit we can take before we die. Because we can't refill Red Hearts anyway, I kind of feel like you definitely just grab the mark. That's that's good. That's That's an improvement.
We got HP, turn that HP into damage. <laughs> yeah, forget angel deals, man. Our our new our new strat is just get to the uh dark room and then uh hope that there's two guppy items. I should have been playing as Azel this whole time. <laughs> This room sucks. We can fly though, maybe it's not so bad. Beautiful. I mean, we could get a deal with the devil right here that has nine lives too. Then die uh, nine times in a heartbreaking loss to the lamb. Sounds like a good time. So I'll, I'll own up to that. I think we can take that, but I'm not gonna risk it. I'm... I'm almost positive that it won't ruin your run, but I also am not willing to do it for five bombs. Keep your head on a swivel, man. <laughs> Every enemy that dies makes it a little easier. Oh! <laughs> I didn't hear no door. The heck is even that? Mom's kisses? It's a good trinket? That wasn't blood clot. That was that was mom's DHLs, exactly. It's an HP up trinket, really? Bro, open up. It's not even that good, like... I can do it. Yo! <laughs> <laughs> nah, we're fine. It's, we have fun here. That's good damage, man. That was close. Just get him, get him, get him. Whoa, hey, <laughs> easy there. Oh, <laughs> all right. Mom's heart, get owns. Now don't use it on Satan. Maybe we can fight Hush real quick. <laughs> Just kidding, unless. <clears throat> Still going, okay. Don't lose focus, we're, we're two floors away. I still would bet on a loss right now and that's not sandbagging I'm I would bet on a loss I knew that was coming because we don't have the means to kill the lamb yet but if we make it to the next floor we get an incredible moment of opening like Four chests and hoping for the best. You're actually a piece of crap, but I'm going to take it. And I'm going to use it against you. This trinket heals you every time you use a key on a door or a chest. That's actually potentially awesome. I don't think that would ruin the challenge. I don't know. At this point, we're, getting, we're about to have to make some... Oh, also, it doesn't do that. Okay, so never mind. Um, that's, that's a good item. Don't lose focus, you can't take those. Don't lose focus, you can't take that. You can take that, though.
The rune is really... It, it could be tempting if it weren't for the fact we'd have to fight two, like, late-game bosses to try to get it. <laughs> Someone said, you gotta. <laughs> Come on, what do you mean? Oh, these guys. Spiders, please. <laughs> you gotta pick your oh, you gotta pick your moment. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Satan, baby, don't press the space bar. We're okay. Don't press, don't press Q either. Let's go. No! Oh! That hurt, that hurt. We didn't have to... We didn't have to be in that position. That's what hurts. But if you just live... He's not frozen. You're not Elsa. Or Anna. Just live till the next floor. Let's go. Nine lives in the Suicide King. Easiest win of my life coming right up. Help. Yep. We lived, baby. No, don't even try it, mister. No, thank you. Okay, dokey. We have a chance. So mom's knife is very good. None of them are nine lives, though. Does satanic Bible keep you alive? Like, is it okay to take Satanic Bible on It's the Key? I think it is. You know what? That's enough for me, man. That's enough for me. Why wouldn't it? Well, because it gives us HP, so I'm a little scared of it, but... Um, I'm going to try to... Oh, that's pretty nasty. Please just kill- yeah, 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 you gotta kill him before holy water runs out. What the heck? Dude, this run- don't lose focus. It genuinely, genuinely has a chance. We can't pick up battery charges, so it's gonna be kind of a nightmare. For a little bit. We may never be able to feel okay using the HP required to get Mom's Knife. So we may just try to stack up a couple of extra Spirit Hearts and then tank the Lamb. We also could get items here. Including... Nine lives. Drop the left hand. That's, that's a tough one for me to say yes to. Lord, show me how to say yes to this. Alexander Hamilton. That, that's the kind of thing that I'll... Ah, I hate you! <laughs> oh, well. It was a good try. That one was a good... Considering the fact that we had, like, 2 HP for the entire...